What's going on YouTube? This is what we Josh do and Google has sent us this massive box. I do know what's in here and as of today, right now, you can use this with your Google on a router, which I still use to this day. It has gotten rid of every other router that I've ever used and it's the only thing I am using or care to use at the moment. It's fast, it's small, it takes up no room. I've been using it since I got it back when I did the video, which I don't even remember how long ago that was. But yeah, I have never uh, unhooked it or not used it. Except to maybe try other routers and then go back to it. But that's about it. All right, so we have lots of things in this box. So, oh my goodness. This is quite awesome. Then. And then here we have some more stuff. And that's about it. All right, so we have this box here. It says it has Philips Hue 10 watts in it. So let's go ahead and open this box up and see what's in here. This is pretty exciting. I am very excited to have new features with my OnHub router. I mean, it is a device that can be constantly updated overnight while you're sleeping and no downtime at all so holy crap i've never had anything like this before so this is a first for me what in the world is all this well, this is exciting thank you google <laughs> oh man limitless possibilities connected you oh my goodness it's a starter kit for starters like me apparently and Wow, okay, so we have two of them. I'm really curious to see what is... Oh, it's a shell. Oh my word, this is exciting! <laughs> oh man, this is so exciting. Alright, so... Let's go ahead... And... Get this... Undressed... And we have some more to cut off. <laughs> oh, my. Oh, I just thought about this. This is for the uh, TP-Link one. And that's the one I kept. I The Asus one kept disconnecting on me randomly. And I just gave it away. I don't even remember who I gave it to. I think it was a family member. Oh, my. That is so stinking cool. Oh, my word. My router just got pimped out. <laughs> they pimped my router. <laughs> All right. That looks pretty freaking slick. You got the on hub there. Uh, it is behind me. I can't really adjust it and <laughs> show you that. Uh, with my lights and everything. So I will uh, go ahead and just include a picture of what this looks like uh, when it's on my on hub router. Now in here, we have... Dude... This is ridiculous. This is ridiculous. I'm going to have to like replace the bulbs in my living room with these or, or something. I'm going to. Oh my gosh. What in the world? What in the world? Oh my word. Okay. So that land port on the back is going to be used right here. So you have to do that. It's like that's a button. And then you got indicator lights, internet, ethernet, power. Pretty cool stuff. We have the bulbs. Weigh a little bit. 800 lumens. All right. Oh, my. That's not good. Oh, I grabbed that, too. Yikes. Okay. That's probably shipping and handling's fault. They, uh, I can't believe I grabbed it, by the, grabbed it up top like that. So there we go. At least they gave me two sets there. Um power cord oh i'm so, oh man i grabbed that right at the top i'm glad that didn't cut me that would have sucked look at that it's like shattered i'm sure it just got mishandled like dropped during shipping or something and so you just go ahead and put the breakaway on here boom there you go it's on there you can disconnect it later if you'd like to ethernet cable to hook it up to the uh port on the back of your on hub router and then the power cord Oh, man. That kind of sucks. I got a bulb that... Now it's wasted. I can't... I'm not using that thing. 
But at least I have another kit here. That's going to be the exciting thing. I'm not going to let that get me down. <laughs> and so there we go. Let's open this one up. Hopefully none of these are cracked. Uh, it's the same exact thing. Grab it by the top there. No, nope. nothing wrong with that one. Nothing wrong with that one. And nothing wrong with that one. All right. So again, give this thing power. Connect this to the back of your on-hub router with that LAN port there. And then these bulbs will talk to it. I will include a brief little video for my phone. This might seem like a really weird place to do this, but uh, nonetheless, I got my Nexus 6P here. And if I go to the home control, I can see my Philips Hue. And I'll click view on here. And it's going to tell me that it's connected and there are my devices. I'm gonna go ahead and click Philips Hue. And I can choose all lights and turn them off. So I got one in the bathroom and one right there. I don't have anywhere else I can really do it besides ceiling bulbs. So let's go ahead and turn the lights off. And now it's dark. So we're gonna turn it back on. And there you go. And you can even adjust just how bright they are using this app. And you can control all of them to super freaking dim. And let's turn them back up to full. The all problem I've had is getting this, there we go, that to go to full. Okay, so to change the colors, you can go here to energize. You can go to red or read, and then you can go to relax. And you can also get crazy and change the color to red. That color, that color, blue. <laughs> this is really freaking cool. This is awesome yellow oh my word could you imagine that the things you can do with this and put it back to normal you just do that now I can change it over to this one and then I can go back and adjust just how bright that red is so let's go back down so there we go boom let's go to 100% and then go ahead and just turn them off real quick Want the lights back on no big problem <laughs> This is really freaking cool. And if you want to just do one at a time, you can do that. So one is in here, I believe. Yep, one is in here. Two is in the living room. Let's turn it back on. <laughs> this is so stinking cool. Uh, now, obviously, you can adjust the brightness of one or the other. And you can go to two, change that one to purple. And it changed back there. And then I'm going to go back to one and change that to, let's do something completely different, green. There we go, got green in here, purple in there. Uh, so let's go back, and if you wanna quickly get all of them to the same thing, you can go to concrete. And now they are all the same. There you go, that's my best example. Uh, Parent, it was easy, I just connected it to my router, uh, opened the app up, it said set up devices, it did take a few minutes for it to all show up. And then from there, I said press the button on the on, on the little thing, and I did. And it took like half a second once it worked, and it paired, and it was quick, and it was over, and it was easy. There's my on-hub router. I've got the Ethernet cable running down through this mess, ugly mess of cables, connected to this little guy right here. And I'll show you how it works from here. This is definitely a little bit awkward filming the ceiling, but uh, <laughs> we could go ahead and go to the lamp too and turn that one off, and it cuts that one off. And if I go to the other lamp, it cuts that one off. And I'll have the third bulb plugged in because I don't have anywhere to plug it at the moment. But uh, so we can go ahead and go back to all lights, turn them all on, and I have them set to, I uh, believe, energize. Yep, I have them set to energize. Concrete's more of a yellow light. I really like Energize a lot. I can go ahead and change it over to green. Or just like before, I can change anything I want. But I really like Energize. Energize is a really nice color. And may, and what I liked about before is I couldn't control the brightness of the lights in my room. Now, I can open this app up and I can do that. I can go ahead and set them to 50%. Or maybe I don't want that much light at all. I can go ahead and bring it down. Or maybe I want to crank them all the way up. <laughs> I really really like that. Maybe I'm playing a video game and I'm too lazy to hit the switch. I could just go boop. All the lights are off. 
this is pretty freaking awesome and I am so excited right now. <laughs> If you enjoyed the video, please let me know by giving it a thumbs up. I'd greatly appreciate it. If you're new to my channel, please consider hitting that subscribe button. Please follow me on Twitter and Instagram if you're not doing so already. This is What Would Josh Do, and I'm out.